So I have this SSD for a while. I've been using it for video editing. So it has this unlocker on it. So every time I have to insert my password in order to open it, unlock it. And I didn't really mind it, it's fine. But just recently I bought a Blackmagic Pocket Cinema 6K camera and I did some research and I find out that um, the SSD actually would be perfect card for me to record on. So I decided to use my SSD on this Blackmagic camera instead of using ST or CF cards. I want to try this SSD on my Blackmagic camera. But the problem is when I plug it into my uh, Blackmagic camera, it doesn't even recognize it. So I guess it probably because of uh, the unlocker system. So I decide to just delete it from my SSD. Surprisingly, it's much harder than I thought. So I tried so many ways. I format it in this utility, it's still there. Every time I plug in, the unlocker pops up and try to show all the disks and format from the mother disk, the upper level disk, um, still, I can't get rid of it. It seems like so many people have the same problem, but they don't know how to delete it. Finally, I decided to speak with someone from the SanDisk. After I spoke with some tech support, so they told me, actually, there's no way you can erase this unlock system from the SSD. The only way I don't want to use password, I have to change the setting. But I don't see the app on my Mac. They gave me this link, asked me to reinstall it. So you guys can go here if you don't have the system. If you have the system, it would be much easier. I guess you can just go ahead and change the setting. If that's the case, I don't think you don't even need to watch this video. But just in case, if you're wondering how to, you know, get rid of it. So you can install it on your computer, put your password and set the password. You know, you can just change the setting to you don't require the password anymore. So that will not only prevent you to put in your password on this device, which is my Mac. Um, it won't ask for a password on any other device. Then I plug in into my Blackmagic, voila, it recognized it. So that's simple. So you just don't have to go for how to delete it, how to clear it. All you gotta do is just, you know, change the setting, that's it. There's no way you can get rid of it. So, you know, just don't waste your time on it. I hope I can save tons of time for someone that, you know, having the same problem. And I do want to mention that before you use your SSD on your Blackmagic camera, go there, go on the screen to format it. So Blackmagic is doing really good job on format the cards. So you have to put your fingers on there for three seconds to format it. I think that's a really good extra security for accidentally deleting any footage you shot on the camera. And lastly, uh, if you guys still interesting, I will show some of the clips that I shot on my Blackmagic uh, on this SSD. I didn't have time to color anything, it's just a test footage, so I just put a lot on it. And the benefit of using SSD, that allows me to film the 6K highest quality. Um, so you can jump in and still have really good image quality. So that's it guys. Uh, if you are also a filmmaker like me, you're more than welcome to watch some of my show films on my channel and if you're not a filmmaker you just came here for sandy's unlocker problem you can still watch my show films on my channel so anyway bye for now mm -hmm.